Springfield-based Roseburg Forest Products says it's investigating its involvement in starting the mill fire. A spokesperson for the company tells us an equipment malfunction may have caused the fire. NBC5's Derek Strom is live in our newsroom now with that story. Derek. Craig, Roseburg Forest Products says a pile of ash in one of its buildings and weed may have caused the mill fire. A spokesperson tells me that some equipment used to cool down that ash may have malfunctioned. Now, the Roseburg operates the veneer mill at the center of the mill fire. It's, it thinks its water spraying machine from a third party manufacturer may not have done its job. You can see in the footage from wildfire cameras and eyewitnesses the mill building burn. The company says it's already planning to put up $50 million for community restoration. It says three of its own employees lost their homes in the fire. We're saddened by uh, the loss of life that did occur. Uh, we are you know, uh, disheartened by the impact that it's had on so many residents. And so we want to make sure we're doing everything we can to help uh, uh, help everybody recover and rebuild. The company says it anticipates the investigation will be completed in two weeks. Hillen says the company wants to work as quickly as possible to figure out the cause of the fire. Now, the company says it will be making another announcement next Wednesday regarding how residents can get money from that community fund. Hillen says they're cooperating with all investigators. Live in the newsroom, Derek Strom, NBC5 News.